Hey Falcons! So Monday, which is today, there is going to be a soccer game against North at 7 and it is here. And then Thursday, there's going to be a volleyball game and that is at home as well, also against North and again at 7. Be there. Hey Falcons, are you ready to get hyped up for our logo game? Well, we have a pep rally this Friday during school. We have a few performances by the band, Harrison Dance Company, and the cheer team. We also have a few games for the student body to sign up for, so make sure you sign up for those. Friday, we also have a Poco game. It's a blue out at seven against Pontiac at home, so be there for me. This Friday, we'll be having the tailgate and parade. So the school store will be open from 5 to 7.30 for community shopping, so people can shop things. As I'm sure all of you know, this week is Spirit Week. Something that I'm sure you don't know is that it's actually a competition. This week, every single day, the class with the highest amount of participation will get to pick the school appropriate music that will be played during lunch. So make sure that your teachers are counting and make sure that you do your most to do your best with this Spirit Week. Are you interested in homecoming decorating? You can help set up on Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays after school, as well as on Saturday from 8 to noon. There will be homecoming tickets that will be sold during lunch in the auditorium hall or after school in Mrs. Berger's room, which is room 405. Guest passes are due on Wednesday. You know flowers are the most beautiful thing in the earth. So I was wondering if this homecoming I could go with the first one. So Gabrielle Ball, will you go to Poco with me? How do you mentally prepare for a game? I listen to music a lot and I pray. Uh, I mentally prepare for a game by most time we listen to music, uh, try and get the team as hype as possible. Um, we pray before every game. I listen to some young boy. The entire day before a game, we stay locked in. We keep our mind on the game, keep our mind on the opponents and what's coming. Just listen to music and watch film. Mute the group chat and don't talk to none of my teammates till the game start. How do you balance school and football? Uh, well, in between school and football, when we're not playing football after school, I do my homework um, so I don't have to do it when I get home. And then when it's practice time, we work hard, um, get ready for our games. You know, it's my fourth year uh, in the IB program. One of the things they teach us is to be balanced. I just make sure to get all my schoolwork done while also attending all practices and all mandatory meetings. I really just do most of my homework in class and then come to football, so I don't got nothing to do at home. How do you feel about the win you're going to get at the homecoming game? I mean, you know, we're going to get a fat dub. It's going to be a blowout. Not, not really much to say to it. We're going to have fun. We're going to celebrate after homecoming next day. I feel amazing. You feel me? Like, it's going to be an easy game. Y'all better come and show out. Oh, God. It's going to be a fat W. You already know. 50 piece on a dome top. Hi, are you interested in healthcare, public speaking, or leadership? Do you like the adrenaline of competing? Are you creative? Then HOSA is for you. HOSA is an extremely fun and interactive club where you'll make memories for life and build a community with people you can trust and lean on. Everyone can find a place at HOSA, so you should join. We are meeting in room 105 next Monday, October 3rd. See you there. Join or you'll end up like me. Attention Falcons, do you like freedom, the Constitution, posters, and money? If so, 
the Social Studies Department has a contest for you. Create a poster that represents the concept of freedom and turn it into any Social Studies teacher by Friday, September 30th for a chance to win one of these great prizes. Student Council will be selling blizzards for $5 Oreo and cookie dough this Wednesday. First come, first serve. Hey Falcons, you like, are you desperate for service opportunities? Are you desperate to make something because you have no, you have a lot of time? Are you desperate to help kids in need? Well, I got the opportunity for you. What if you make blankets for kids in need? And that's where the Fleets and Thank You opportunity comes in. And the cafeteria on October 5th from 2.40 to 5 p.m. You just have to pay a little fee of $15 and you'll get two service hours making blankets for kids in need. I think you'll like that, wouldn't you? Go Falcons! Rawr!